morning. I doubt this video is going to make it to President Trump's uh, attention, but I, I do want to reach out just once again. I'm a, Mr. President, I want to thank you for all the wonderful things you've done for this country. I myself, I was on food stamps all throughout the Obama administration, near the end on Section 8, all kinds of things. And now, thank God, I'm self-sufficient, making more money than I ever had before. And I attribute that to the changes in, in the economy that, that you have accomplished as a faithful servant of God and a servant to, to our country. And I'm a proud American and I'm a proud supporter of you. And, a pr and I pray for you. And I pray for Vice President Pence. And I pray for all of you and your families. And I pray for this country. And I'm a proud American. And it, it, saying that, I am of the Jewish faith, pretty obviously. I'm a rabbi. And the only criticism I've ever had, and I know, Mr. President, you don't like to hear criticism, and I, so I do this very respectfully. Um, and it's perhaps, uh, you know, innocuous, and, uh, you know, I, I have no, I, I, I know where you're coming from, I just, I feel that I have to express this. At the Republican Jewish Coalition, recently, you were, you were speaking to a group of Jewish Americans, and you referred to Benjamin Netanyahu as your Prime Minister. Similarly, during the Hanukkah event, you spoke of Israel as your country. Now, while I have a religious devotion to the Holy Land and to Jerusalem, although most of that devotion is to the heavenly Jerusalem, I have religious devotions to other places, to Uman in, in uh, Ukraine, to Lezhensk in Poland, uh, to Curious Joel here in New York, where, and, and to Muncie in New York, and, and, and in Queens many, many holy people buried. Those are also places of pilgrimage. But I have zero connection as a Jewish American to Benjamin Netanyahu or to the State of Israel. I'm an American of the Jewish faith. I'm not an Israeli. America is my country, and you are my president, and I have no prime minister. I have rabbis who I go to for religious guidance, but for government, you are my president, Mr. Mr. Trump. Not, and, and I have no prime minister, and certainly not, certainly not Benjamin Netanyahu. I have no more of a connection to Benjamin Netanyahu than I have to Theresa May. I see England and what they call the modern state of Israel as valuable American allies. And I have a religious devotion to the Holy Land. And I care about my co-religionists, the pious people who live in Jerusalem and B'nai Brak and other cities in the Holy Land. Many of whom, if not most of whom, do not consider Benjamin Netanyahu to be their Prime Minister, although some of them might be voting for him, those who do vote. Many of them don't vote at all because many of them would rather be American citizens, to be honest, than to be Israeli citizens. I know people who, from my community, who come to America, immigrated here legally, and burned their Israeli passport as, as soon as they got their American citizenship and their American passport because they wanted to have nothing to do with the state of Israel. And so it's offensive as an American, and I'm not going to get into anything more than that, but to say to Jewish Americans, your Prime Minister Netanyahu, your country Israel, no. Mr. President, you are my president. Donald Trump, you are my president, and, America, and the United States of America is my country. God bless. Thank you.